Annika and welcome to or back to my channel. Today I'm going to be filming a fall weekend morning routine and just taking you through my typical morning on the weekend. Today is Sunday, October 23rd and it is currently 9 a.m. I like to take my weekend mornings a lot slower than my weekdays because obviously I have nothing to do. I have no rush really so i just like to take it slow and relax and enjoy it i got up around nine i just stayed in bed for a little bit this morning and got on my phone a little and read some of my book i'm currently reading in my dreams i hold a knife by ashley winstead i finished it starts with us last night i gave it four stars it was such a good read if you read It Ends With Us, you should definitely read it. It feels like an extended epilogue. I love getting more of the characters and more of their relationship, if you know what I'm talking about. But if you want to keep up with my current reads, then you can follow me on Goodreads. I always have it linked down below because I'm always updating that. And obviously, my mornings every weekend look a little bit different, but they're all kind of structured similarly. Yeah, just taking it slow and enjoying my time off. Just kind of doing things that make me feel good and make me happy. So I think right now Renee and I are gonna go on a little coffee run and pick up a coffee or a chai or something. During the week, I mostly like 100% make my coffee from home, but it's nice on the weekend to like get a little treat and to go out together and just treat ourselves to going to like buy a coffee. But I hope you enjoy this really cozy morning routine. It's gonna be super relaxing, super chill, and I can't wait to take you along for the rest of my morning. coffee we went to press today and i got my usual almond milk latte amazing okay guys i just got home i got my coffee i already feel so much better because i have this so now i'm just going to get dressed really quickly i'm just going to straighten my hair and then do a little bit of makeup because we're going to go to church a little bit later and i also want to take some instagram pictures with this outfit idea that i have in my mind Hey guys, I just finished the hair. I just did sleek like straight hair for today because I desperately need a haircut and my bangs are like so outgrown that kind of nothing else works. I'm going to move on to makeup. Just gonna do my everyday makeup routine. So I have been using this e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer and I like it okay. I mean, it gets the job kind of done. What is your favorite like pore filling primer? Like smoothing primer? I need a good one. Do you have a good recommendation or like a favorite? Please let me know. Um, so the foundation I love is the Kosas one. It's called the Kosas Skin Improving Foundation. Love this one. C cream I love is actually from Supergoop. I discovered this when I worked for them over the summer. It is the only CC cream that I have found that actually has coverage. Like it's, it's more than a tinted moisturizer and I love that it has sunscreen in it. Obviously it's like an extra layer. So it like actually covers, which I love. use this one by milk it is in the shade work done with my makeup 
makeup. I'm gonna take a break from getting dressed really quickly because Renee made breakfast and I'm starving. So let's go eat a little bit. Breakfast is served and today we're having waffles with berries and fruit. They look so good. And in honor of the vlog and the season, these are the waffles that we made. It's the Nature's Path Organic Pumpkin Spice flavor, which I've never tried before, but I'm sure they're gonna be delicious. Also, I just got this super cute little cup with bees on it from Anthropology. I did a haul unboxing these on my TikTok and it's like my new favorite cup. I just poured my coffee in here because it just makes drinking coffee so much more fun. And while I eat my breakfast, I'm gonna read some of my book. I'm on page two. Also, you definitely can't have a fall morning routine without the fall lo-fi, so this is always playing in my house. So now really quickly, before I get dressed, I'm gonna journal for like five or 10 minutes. I just like to try and include this as much as I can, either in the morning or at night, and it just helps like center me before my day. Plus, it's just good for you to like release thoughts that maybe you didn't even know you had that you're building up and just get all of that out before the rest of your day. I always find that it makes me feel so much more like clear-minded throughout my day. And this is the journal that I use. I'll have it linked down below. It's super cute and thick, which I love. Okay guys, I am ready and here's the outfit before I go. I just kept these little clips in my hair because I actually think they look cute. So I think I'm just gonna keep them on. And then I have on this oversized leather jacket from Motel Rocks. It's like a vintage inspired fit, which I really like. And I have on this white little tee from Cuts Clothing. They make really cute and high quality little basic tees. So I recommend that if you're looking for any, you should definitely check them out. They have so much selection on their website. They have all these different colors and all these different fits and styles. And I also like it because they're really thick. I don't know if you can tell, it's not just like a really thin baby tee. Like they feel more high quality and more durable than most. So. Yeah, I've been loving this recently and I also have it in cream and I know I'm gonna get so much use out of them for fall with like layering and throwing them on under blazers or jackets just like this. And if you do find something on cuts or you do want a shot from them, then I will have a link in the description as always. And then I have on this little micro baby skirt from Danielle Guzio and my little ruffle socks with these Prada loafers and my little black bag. But I did wanna get some pictures in this outfit because I think it's super cute and really like fall inspired. It's kind of school girl, but still super comfy. So let's go shoot some Instagram pics and then that will complete this morning routine. Okay, we found a location and now we're gonna shoot the pictures, but I forgot my tripod. I'm just gonna find a place to set you and hopefully you can see the process. because it's already 1.30, which is not morning anymore. 
and we're on our way to church. I just took the Instagram pictures and changed into some cargo pants. I hope you enjoyed this fall morning routine. Let me know if you want me to do a weekday one. This was specifically just my weekend, so it was super chill with like no structure to it really. And it changes every weekend, but that's just what I did today. So I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to follow my Instagram and my TikTok if you want to see some more of my content. I love you all so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.